are a new parent. It's only been a few months, but you can't remember a life before your child. Your little avocado, a simple smile on that innocent face is enough for you to envision a hopeful, infinite future. But one day, you notice your child having unusual, tiny movements. You go to the doctors, not expecting anything bad, but you're given the diagnosis that your child has infantile spasms. All of a sudden, you're being told that your child has this catastrophic epilepsy, that if treatments aren't started immediately, your child will never be the same again. They'll never walk, never talk, never achieve the hopes that you set out for them. On top of that, you're told that current treatments only have a 50-50 chance of working and that these treatments may seriously harm your child. What are you supposed to do with that information? This is the harsh reality of parents to infants suffering from this catastrophic epilepsy. Infantile spasms, which is the focus of my research, affects babies within their first year of life and has a mortality rate of around 35%. These are indeed tiny seizures with big consequences. But what if I told you that the cure to infantile spasms may lie within this avocado that you see on the slide? This avocado is ketogenic, meaning it's high in fat and low in carbohydrates. Perhaps you've heard of the ketogenic diet with relation to weight loss, but today I'm going to tell you about its anti-seizure properties. So my master's research examines the effects of the ketogenic diet using a model of infantile spasms. Through this, we found definitive evidence for the ketogenic diet's remarkable properties to reduce epileptic spasms. We're also the first to show that the ketogenic diet actually works through increasing the acidity in the brain, which is historically known to have anti-seizure properties. With this, we now have an exciting opportunity to treat children suffering from this terrible epilepsy without the risk of serious side effects seen with current treatments. So with the ketogenic diet, your child may have these tiny seizures, but now with not so big consequences.